The following KTAB KFX presentation is brought to you by Sonic, as well as these other fine sponsors. high school football for you tonight as the eighth week of the high school football season comes to a close. It's a big night because some district races are going to start clearing out and of course others will get more confusing. Here's what's coming your way here in just a bit. Cooper at home for their game with Cap Rock. Wiley returns to Bulldog Stadium for the first time in a month. Abilene High taking on district leader Haltom and the Snyder Tigers face off against Greenwood for the top spot in the district. That's all coming up before we take a commercial break. Like I said, it's a busy night. We're going to start in Haltom, Abilene High, losing a tough ball game to the uh, Haltom Buffaloes tonight by the final score of 28 to 14. We'll get to the highlights here in a little bit, but first let's go out. Mary Margaret is with head coach Delvan Cox right now. Thanks a lot, David. I'm out here with Abilene High held, uh, head coach Delvan Cox. The Eagles are coming off a 28 to 14 loss to Haltom out here. Coach, you knew it was going to be a tough game. You knew that these guys were really good and they were undefeated coming into tonight. What made this game so tough tonight? Well, you know, uh, the men, those guys, they're, they're so uh, explosive in the offense. And, uh, man, our defense did a great job. But, you know, in the second half, we only gave up one score that was a fluke play. And, uh, and but, man, I, I was proud of where our kids fought back and, and uh, you know, kept after it and uh, lost to uh, lost the quarterback and uh, had a, a Ezell come in. I thought he did a great job of, of giving us a little spark. Uh, but uh, man, I, I was proud of where our kids kept going. But uh, you know, we gotta we gotta do a better job of, of starting off faster. And because uh, and, and you can't you can't fall behind uh, against good teams like that and and be able to come back. Cal, your team really exemplifies the next man up attitude. You know, the line shifting around all the time, and then he's. Uh, uh, Cal and Seib went down, and Michael or Matthew Uzel came in, and really, you know, had the two touchdowns in the second half. Um, what is what does that say about these kids and their tenacity? Well, it's just you know, it's just kind of the, the Abilene mentality. Um, you know, we've got lots of lots of good kids, uh, great kids, as a matter of fact, and and they all like to play football. And and uh, when it's their turn, they, they're ready to play. And, and uh, I was really proud of the way Uzel came in and stepped in, and I, I'm really proud of the way the kids performed around him and, you know, picked it up a notch uh, uh, for him. So, uh, you know, we did some good things, uh, but uh, you can't you can't do, uh, you can't make those mistakes against a, a good football team. There's a reason why uh, they're 7-0, and and, uh, but uh, they got some good good athletes, and, and uh, we just uh, came up a little bit short tonight. And we really saw in the second half the team coming together and everything start. you know, it was working, we just ran out of time. Um, how do you guys come together again and really come back off these two losses and prepare for next week for Well, you know, we gotta we got to try to earn our spot next week. You know, uh, uh, next week we gotta uh, we got to win or, or, or not make the playoffs. So uh, definitely uh, definitely a, an important game for us. We need lots of fans out there uh, next, uh, next Friday night to, to help us out. And uh, hopefully we'll clean things up and we'll play with a good intensity and, uh, that I know we will uh, and, and, and uh, come out with a victory. Thanks a lot, Coach. That is all that we have from the Metroplex. For BigCountryHomePage.com Sports, I'm Mary Margaret Johnson. Let's go back to David in the studio. All right, we are going to get to those highlights here in just a little bit. Like I said, it's a big night of football. You are in the best place for the coverage, so let's get to it. You're watching KFX, KTAB Football Extreme. It is good to be back. The road to the high school football playoffs can be a bumpy one, but it is definitely worth the trip. Let's check out some classes.